Hi, I'm Mike Rankin, Editor-in-Chief of Creative Pro, and in this video, I'll show you how to use the Touch Type tool in Adobe Illustrator. So here in my file, I have some live text and a placed photo of a cliff. And I'd like the letters on the right side to look like they've fallen off the cliff and were tumbling down. Now this is a perfect job for the Touch Type tool, which allows me to quickly select one character at a time and change its scale, position, and rotation. To use the Touch Type tool, I can either take it from the Tools panel, or I can click a button in the Character panel. And if you don't see this button in the panel, you can display it by going to the Panel menu and choosing Show Touch Type Tool. I'll click that button, and now I can just click a character to select it. And when I do, I get five control points around the character. And you get a hint about what each one does if you move your cursor over it. So with my cursor over the top left point, I get this double arrow indicating that I can drag to change the vertical scale. With my cursor over the bottom right point, I get a double arrow that I can drag to change the horizontal scale. Drag the top right point to scale the character proportionally, and drag the bottom left point or anywhere inside the box around the character to move it. And drag the top point to rotate the character. And since anytime you adjust a character with the touch type tool, it's going to affect the position of all the following characters. So it's best to work from left to right, just so you're not having to go back and forth tweaking things. I'll start by rotating the N here a little bit. And then I'll rotate the G. and move it down. Rotate the D and move it down. And continue on with the rest of the letters. And I'll also reduce the scale of each one a bit just to make them look like they're getting farther away from us. And I could continue tweaking this until I was fully satisfied. And remember, this remains live editable text. So if I decided that this should be a lowercase d, I can take the type tool and change it. Just be ready to make some more adjustments as needed. Okay, that's our look at using the Touch Type tool in Adobe Illustrator. It's a fast and fun way to modify the look of text one character at a time. Thanks for watching this video, and if you want lots more tips like this, be sure to check out creativepro.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel.